Oh goodness, this place is fancy. I love it. Oh man, the design in here is really cool. Can we just like appreciate how this is all set up? That person's got a baseball bat. Am I allowed to go up there? Leave me alone. Okay, whoa, geez. Don't want you to break in my knees or whatever. Just kinda wanna take a look before I go sit at the bar. This is cool. I like that there's an upstairs area too. Yeah. There's a thing I can read over here. What is it? <clears throat> uh, Night City Nightlife. That's a redundant thing. Um, drinks, dancing, debauchery. If you're a dance head like us, don't miss out on Lizzie's. You'll find no better brain dance club in the city, no matter how deep you dig. Modern boxes, solid tech, but most important, the catalog. Chock full of nearly any experience you can imagine. You'll find everything you need to get you off fast or slow, nasty or classy, and everything in between. Don't let the girls at the front door scare you off or kill your buzz. They're wary of newcomers, but once you get in, they'll treat you like one of their own. Trust us, give Livesey's a try and you'll never go anywhere else. <clears throat> we read this already? That seemed kind of uh, familiar. Now, the afterlife, that's a different story. Yeah, I think that's exactly it. We have read that. That's cool. I, again, I'm just kind of enjoying this. We have another one? What's this one? Uh, Slajov, Sl Slavaj, McAllister, and the news again. Uh, pompous butthead or eccentric genius, acclaimed rocker boy McAllister has ruffled feathers yet again following his most recent performance at nightclub ta -tan -tan, whatever. While a rock concert brawl is no big news in itself, several unofficial sources allege it was McAllister who investig or instigated the violent outbreak after hurling a tear gas canister at paparazzi in the crowd. That's, that's pretty um, excessive. Uh, before the booze-fueled melee got heated, the Cartesian duelist premiered new songs, uh, Cybernetic Soul, <clears throat> Mind is Freedom, and uh, Cogito Ergo Sum, which, as usual, have critics divided lyrically. The new singles touch on issues such as the eternal struggle of body and mind, the limitations of our senses, and the search for absolute truths. Some critics consider the new material uh, pseudo-intellectual drivel. Others praise the band's fresh, innovative spin on the genre. Beyond the brawl, even McAllister's headlines are making headlines. When asked in an interview with N54 News what the cryptic title of the track Kagato Ergo Sum meant, the rocker boy replied, Ain't revved by questions from gonk-brained gonk frauds. What are you? Despite, or perhaps thanks to, the numerous controversies ever swirling around uh, Duelist Frontman, his popularity continues to swell. The band's new album is slated for release soon, and you believe, or if you believe the chatter on the net, it'll be entitled, it will be entitled War of Truths. See, that seems like just a Passover thing. But it actually does have importance, right? Because... One of the main characters, Johnny Silverhand, is in fact... Did I miss something over there? I thought I did. Uh, Johnny Silverhand is a... Um, or what do you call it? A, uh, a musician. So it's something to keep in mind is that all this stuff is important. Hey. Also builds the world up. Get you something. Uh, what can I get here? What's on the menu? Oh, I can actually tr trade. Uh, well, well, I'll just sell my junk. Got three bucks. <laughs> um, I don't think there's anything else I want to sell to him. I don't know if I want to be selling this guy like guns. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? Hmm. A big tipper. A big tipper. Generous when I get the answers I'm looking for. Appreciate the gesture, truly. But afraid I don't get paid to talk. Opposite. It's all right, Mateo. Let's wait. Let's wait. Oh. Hello there. She's cool looking. Oh, he's 
Corey. I was like, what's that in my right ear? Evelyn Parker. Yeah, now you were just staring at me like a weirdo. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. <laughs> Why didn't you come over sooner? Or, mmm, tequila of choice. I drink. How would you know? I like to know everything about uh -oh. the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Couldn't tell I got drugged or not. Why meet here? Why we meet here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. Stand up, follow her. Just go quickly. My goodness, when we pull your pants up. <laughs> that was a little excessive. Oh. I just told you. Oh my. Okay, sit down. What you need? Isn't this a non-smoking area? Just Dex had a load okay, to then. say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Uh, I'm the best, or you don't care what Dex thinks. Yeah, that's a good one. So obviously that's reflexes and that's intelligence, I think. Maybe? I'm waiting. You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both know that. You have trouble accepting compliments? No, just think flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? Maybe Dex is beneath you. Have you known each other long? Uh, what, you writing Dex's bio? You writing Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you for this job. Beg your pardon? Curious. Phrasing? Um. Shit, buzz decks right now if you're getting cold feet. I can wait. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fixers in that respect. Used car salesmen. <laughs> I'll go with my gut for now. <laughs> Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Um... You know, just never rolled through that neighborhood. Damn shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must have made a deal with the devil. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What, so Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Let's see here. We can get some uh, questions here. Um, let's ask this. Top dog like you are Nobu's bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. Hmm. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. Yorinobu is a puppet. 
He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Right. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. <laughs> Jeez. Yori Nobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Um. So what's Yorinobu do to walk away with? Unimportant. You focus on the biochip. What could cyberspace's watchers and protectors offer him? Intelligence on his enemies? That doesn't matter in the least. Because you'll make sure the transaction never happens, and I get the chip. Interesting. Wait, neutral Netwatch is mixed up in this? Netwatch provides net security for all corporations and collects eddies in the millions for it. But in this day and age, everyone's in the game and no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Likely in a specialized container, one that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough, provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. <laughs> Fine. Uh, do I want it more? Yeah, let's get more info. One more thing. Data that's on the chip. What is it? Irrelevant entirely. We're talking about data Yorinobu snuck out of Arasaka. What's more, he wants to pass it on to Netwatch. Sounds pretty damn relevant to me. Listen, V, the relic. That's my concern. Your concern? Earning a paycheck. Just get the job done. I'll make sure your bank accounts are sated. <laughs> what else do you know about Yorinobu? Quite a bit, actually. He studied finance and biotech in Tokyo. Probably didn't have a choice in the matter, come to think of it. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu vanished to chase his own dreams. Cut himself off from the corp for years. Long story short, though the black sheep returned, the bitter taste remained. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has always walked his own path. And so has his own designs on the corp. Maybe he does just got a taste for power. All right, let's go risky move with the biochip. Seems to be risking everything with this relic scam. Yes, because he's fallen for the biggest lie this town puts forward. That he can gain and retain control of anything. <laughs> okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Oh, yeah? Got something for you. <laughs> Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. How Jacking off too in those no, boxes. No. Damn the break. It can be a very useful tool. Uh, oh, I'm insulting you. Analyzing nope. details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't <laughs> grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. You mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Um. No, not at all. Yep. Let's see this brain dance. It's fine if she knows him. Judy will help. She's a mox too. Mm -hmm. Besides, we go back uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Oh. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Well, well. <laughs> Sup, girl? <clears throat> hey, there you are. 
This is V. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna be alarmed. Uh, nice. Uh, not bad. Hardware top shelf. Got quite a setup here. Impressive looking setup. Need all this to process brain dances? Mm hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <clears throat> Judy. All right. All right. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's Bigger most pardon? important. So let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Coming at me? I guess just push, pushing past me. It's whatever. Leave me. Get out of her way. Worse. Should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometime. Cool keyboard. So we drop the inside. Let her look, let her rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Uh I think I could take it. I never. What's so raw about it? What do you mean by raw? How's this differ from the ready mates? Huh. Ready maids, provided they're well made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass market shit, so it's pre crafted, hard coded, fenced in, and manageable. A raw one? Well, it's more like a virtue in Viro. Get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Like the newest in Razer keyboards over there. <laughs> they've, they've really gone crazy in the, the far cyberpunk feature. My boots are so cool looking. You like my boots? She, has, she doesn't care about my boots. She should. They're cool. It's going to be interesting. Night. You gotta create your sensory profile first. Okay. A what profile? No. Profile away. Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingle. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah, can't see anymore. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend Whoa. it's an eye exam. Whoa, that's weird. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. Can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we? Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks. Besides, won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. What'd you choose? Corner store hold up in Haywood. Real amateurs. Don't even know where I got it. Suits our needs perfectly though. You ready? Uh, sure. Boot it up. Let's see what this is. Mm -hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, one. It's very bright. I have no idea what I'm in for on this. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. I have no control over this. Down, everybody, on the ground. What I see you kissing the flooring. Muddy, now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God. Whoa, yeah, hey, uh, uh, now. Before I blow your fucking head off! Oh, I've been there. Slow. 
Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. Uh, could have warned me. A flash of intense shock. I can still feel it. I remember. Fuck. That last second. Could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up. Let's switch over to editing mode. Okay. So I get to relive that moment over and over? <laughs> is that what this is? I'll sever the link to the BD roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Oh, Full yeah. cam control in analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go okay. in, snatch the cash. Unpause the recording, watch the scene. We yeah. The BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Uh, hold Q to rewind. Back to the top. Okay. Neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Q and E, gotcha. Don't get creative. You go in. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Okay. So, play. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. So he gives... They'll spot it. can only scan clue during moments when it's perceivable by the person recording the brain dance. Okay. Extra for a wicked adrenaline high. So he gets a gun here, right? Yeah. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. So, okay, I'm going to read this. Indicates current selected layer. Visual layer, thermal layer, sound layer. So I'm on visual. Gotcha. Bold sections on the track indicate a scannable clue. The clue will be highlighted for the duration of the sequence if the editor is set to the correct layer. Clues may overlap each other. The spot where they overlap on the recording track will be especially bright. After being successfully scanned, clues disappear from this the thing. Okay, that's good to know. Excellent. Let's move on. So I have now I have gotten that. Up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To okay. see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay. Scan that. Pack of cigs, case of brosif, and a couple of zappers. Okay. We have a deal today on two flavors. Cody Wait. and yeah. Serpent. Everybody! I didn't want to... Any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like it was happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sounds, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Okay, I want to rewind. <laughs> to this, right? So we had that sound. But there was something we hadn't scanned, which is this. Okay. How do I switch between available brain and so it's left shift? Okay. You can analyze extra layers in the raw stuff the rollers fiberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. 
Huh. Hella nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gunk at the counter. Okay. Fast forward to where the customer is hit. Whoops. Like the limits of the reality recorded by the Get out. The editor won't let you outside. Make sense? Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the Okay, whatever. Can I fast forward it faster? Oh, I, I held R, not E. Ah, gotcha. Now I see why I'm not fast forwarding. So we want to... So scanning works on Pete. There we go. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. The wounded chick. I did. I did scan her. Oh, uh, scanning again? All right, uh. next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Right, so when he gets no, shot. Drop you. So he's about to get no. the money. Okay, let's go ahead and play. See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. Oh, okay. So, screen right there. Scan that. Okay. So it's zooming in. Own Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. <laughs> BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. I think I'm good. Yeah. That's okay i i get what they're going for with that and i think it's really cool conceptually but i don't know how yeah. good that's going to be to play Pretty out good, right? throughout the game too bad most of the bds we do here are only good for flogging the log big part anyway you ready to do this look at your wreck i don't know i Ugh, let's take a break still feel like that kid when <sighs> yeah i think i'm done v there's no time Together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Buck to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? A runner for my crew. Security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Um. Evelyn? I won't get a damn thing out of this without T-Buck. Judy, please. Ev, she wants to bring a runner in? What part of that don't you understand? How do I know she'll only perch in this footage? Observe, not fuck with anything. Me. I'm your guarantee. Yeah, right. Help me. This one last time. I promise everything will work out. Just like we planned. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive. All right, this seems like I kind of butted in there, but I guess it'll work. Hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen, I got some useful footage from Konpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Konpeki? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Uh, Judy and, no, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm important, Bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jack in it to your tech now. Mm, yeah, you've got check in. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Uh -huh. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. I hope this doesn't go wrong. All right, V, eyes open. Got to find out where your nobu's keeping the relic. Examine the brain dance in analysis mode to find the relic. Okay, can I pause? So let's go ahead and go to editing mode. 
Examine the brain dance in analysis mode. Well, I don't know if I want to analyze anything. So we scanned him. Not sure what that is. Although there's apparently more stuff here. But I... Oh, yeah. Stuff out there. It's an alarm system. Alarm firmware's fresh. But saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to the sieve. Hmm. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Cool. There's also a motion sensor camera. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Okay, and then let's go back to play mode. You look like a cut of fuckable meat. Wow. You? Evelyn, she... I felt her fear. Okay, it's just like a giant robot. Sure got it under control quick, too. Cool. Let's, um, let's reverse. Uh -huh -huh. I think we need to scan the thing there on the door. No? Then what, what is in this tiny moment for us to scan? Can I back it up, maybe? What are we seeing here? It's a brief moment, but I don't see it. Oh goody, this, I think I have an idea of what this is gonna be like for the rest of the game, which is us being like, I don't understand. What, there's something here. There's a visual thing somewhere, no idea where it's at. And uh, I think maybe we skip this one and come back to it, it's probably better. Although she was like looking at something in her hand. Maybe that's what it was. Okay. It's another motion sensor camera. Okay. Here, let's let's do this. Oh, there's layers too, I forgot. Okay, let's let's um go back to playback mode and let's watch it through. No. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Okay. So, do do do. Scan the apartment security in the audio layer. Scan your Nubu's phone as he talks. Okay. Uh, we need to shift layers. Scan his phone. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old graybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny so, frozen bubble. I need to. I should not even why is it not letting me pause? <laughs> All sorts of stuff to a scan. Who's this? Have we have not seen eye to eye for the past twenty years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must not provide them. In Heard that? Relic docs got to be around here somewhere. Look for them. Okay, so basically, that was that's mildly annoying because it popped up like. You know things that i could be scanning but at the same time it didn't want me to ventilation and cooling servers gotta be fancy doodads in here need to be controlled like it wanted me to listen to the rest of his conversation all right so let's switch back to um what is it tab there we go play uh, sorry to make you wait business can be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense, edgy. A moment. It will pass. Hmm. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus on me. 
Oh, got any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom, nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. I'm just letting this all play out. So that way I can just go through and scan everything. Just bam, 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 bam. I think that's going to be the quickest way to do these. Very nice. But I beg your pardon. Already. Just a sec. <laughs> Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, you'll like this. I got to scan whatever was on his data pad there. Oh, fuck. It... It's like I'm really... V, eye on the prize. Waru ikome. I miss this. You. I know. End of recording. Yeah, all right. So we're going to back this sucker up. Let's go to editing mode. Pause. Back up. Oh, I'm on the wrong layer. I want to be on visual layer. Scan this, please. If you can. Nope. I didn't want to play. Back it up. Yeah. <laughs> Manual details a special chip control container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So chips got to stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. Okay, thermal layer is now unlocked. Left shift. Oh yeah. <laughs> Definitely see the thermal layer. Um, I, I could go through all of this, but I don't want to look at that stuff yet. I want to back this up. Um, there was something here. That's a gun. Okay. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Good. Good to know. Let's back it up. And obviously, okay, I see the thing right here for the... Uh. We'll wait here, and then we'll shift for. Ooh, gotta definitely scan that. Air conditioning, standard model for hotels of this caliber. Temp matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Temp fluctuations, risk of damage. Right. Okay. We're gonna switch layers. Let's back it up. This is kind of tedious. I'm not gonna lie. I like the concept of it though. It's really cool. But again, a little um, a little tedious. What else do I need to scan? Can I scan his data pad before he picks it up, or his phone? I guess it was his phone. Right. What else am I trying to scan here? Um, we scan that. Oh, there's something here. Automated turret. Oh, goody. Okay, yeah, definitely don't want to deal with that. Scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. It wants me to scan Can't thermal cubes. Ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. But there's still clearly something to scan that I haven't been able to. Right? Leaving signal range. What, what have I not been able to scan that is on this one? Honestly, no idea. <laughs> Just no, no idea. Maybe it's under here? Something to do with the table? No, all right, let's back this up. I think, um, okay, so we have the thermal layer here. It's this. Oh, Donaghy's. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Hmm. Okay. Let's back it up. Again, I'm not sh I guess on the thermal layer, I can see it a little bit better than before. But I'm not sure where those visual layer things were. Oh, something definitely here to scan somewhere. Nope, stop. Play. Okay, back her up. Right there. It's a fridge. Just a fancy ass fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. 
or so you think. Backing it up. Oop, there's something else. Over there. Hidden safe. Right. Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Right. Your Nobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We've got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. I kind of wish that I could get this other, like, visual stuff. Because apparently there's something for this, but, you know. I'm not, I'm not seeing anything. We got the camera. Okay, I, I guess we'll just exit. We'll just get it done with. Get everything you need? Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Cool. Fine. Sure. <laughs> I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Ah, uh, we really needed that recording, Judy. We needed that recording, Judy. BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. <laughs> thing going on between them? Feels like there's a thing going on between them. <sighs> okay, and I can talk to Ev. Can I talk to Judy? Like, yo, thanks. Hey, can I... One sec. I know, you want to talk to me. But can I, like... Can I loot <laughs> Judy's place? <laughs> can I talk to her? Thanks for the help. Till next time. No, thanks for the help. Thanks, Judy. Really. And don't worry. I know what I'm doing. She she doesn't seem to care. She's like, whatever. All right, fine, Ev. Let's walk. Sure. Sound was kind of weird there. Well, what do you think? Um, connection to Yornabu. What's its nature exactly? I think I see how you know so much about Yorinobu. It's simple. Men like pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex. Biz. And biz only. <laughs> you sure Yorinobu doesn't suspect a thing? You're sure Yorinobu doesn't expect this kind of move from you? <laughs> He's got no idea. Trust me. He's too busy with Netwatch to give me that kind of attention. Besides, even if... Some suspicion takes root in his mind. It shouldn't matter. He won't react in time. And that's something you'll handle, right? Hmm. You're not worried? Arasaka will flag and screen anyone who's had dealings with Yorinobu. Oh, they'll have a long list then. Packed full of big names. Much bigger than mine. You tell me who they check first. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats? Or a little bedroom plaything like me? Right, I see. Intel on Yorinobu, the chip, the BD from Compeki. When's are right, plan's perfect. A job like this comes one in a million. Hmm, thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. That you're not sending me into the sort of shit I can't wait out of. V. I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together. Really. Trust me that I got this. I... Okay, we'll try. So, what now? V. Do this job for me. 
I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. Really? Uh. You want to fuck over our fixer? I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman, and a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows and actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. A mistake like that'll cost you your rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight. Your choice. Hmm. I'll think about it. I got thoughts. If I agree. There'll be hell to pay. For sure. I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. Okay. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. I leveled up. Heck yeah. Uh, let's do our level up real quick. Um, I kind of want to put more into int and reflexes. Ah, it's cool is what the, the, that one is. Okay. So the, what I was doing with those, uh, reactions or the way that I could talk was between my reflexes and cool, uh, intelligence, obviously not super high there, but <clears throat> I think, I think we may do some intelligence stuff. Um, well, actually, you know what? We, we do also want to get some of this stuff continued to, uh, dodging recovers 15% stamina. Increases bleeding duration. Combos with blades have 15% chance to apply bleeding. Defensive attacks with blades deal 200%. Yeah, I like these so much. They're so good. Um, I need level 12 in order to get those. Uh, I mean, getting a blade, it would end up being a 30% chance to apply bleeding would be nice. But I feel like... I really also want to go ham into hacking, but let's, I don't know. I think, I think maybe at this point we put a little bit more into, um, blades and we try to get that a little bit better. So go ahead and put another one into reflexes and hope that that's the case. Now, when it comes down to skipping decks, I kind of feel like, I kind of feel like, my, okay. And he's calling what? us. How things look in this week for sure. Okay. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance at that ship without that buy. To work then, Miss V. Hmm. I kind of feel like, um, I'm not going to read that right now. I, I kind of feel like my character, my V, you know, the character I'm playing as. What a sweet would not I mean she's a street kid she knows go what it would mean to, to kind of go back on him I don't know if she would go and screw him over that's a tough choice though I'm gonna have to really think about that